This right here is a Samsung Galaxy S21 Plus Ultra 5G phone that I found on Wish.com and today we're going to go through and buy it. Now first up, I just want to be clear that this phone, the Samsung and Galaxy S21 Plus Ultra is um, a measly $1,200. What we're going to be doing here is we're going to be getting the I'm gonna get a nice, I'm gonna go with black because I think that looks clean. Oh, so this is a measly $150 compared to the, uh, well, yeah, almost $1,200. So yeah, it was clearly, clearly gonna be a great product that we're gonna get. If it comes in the mail and it looks like this, I would be very, very surprised. I, I don't think we're gonna get something that even looks close to this, but um, we'll see what we get when we buy it. Uh, rear HD camera, okay. Uh, you've got, we've got a 14 millimeter transistor process that's like huge not nanometers and millimeters um and makes young people who love the young and stayed with other popular games the game's eyes on and lower the new interactive design makes the operation simple and simple the use of the mobile phone is so simple and straightforward everything is handy um you've got a 10 core processor you don't even have 5G included in the frequency, which it's advertising as 5G here. Oh boy, 5G radiation will need the tinfoil hat. And you've got the cameras, you've got all the different functions. I'm assuming gravity sensor, calendar, calculator, audio recorder, video recorder. Oh boy, product images and models and data functions, performance specifications are for reference only. We may improve the above contents for details. Please refer to the product and product description unless otherwise stated the data contained in this website is in our internal test results the comparison are compared with our product so what do we have included we have a smartphone a charger adapter well we already have more than apple does uh headphones way more than apple does user manual screen protector and a phone case wow every contact should not forget everything experience the miracles and emotions in life feel the fantasy and reality in nature be loyal to your love be brave Brave to explore unknown and distant places and record every content experience with the camera. Thanks for watching. If you like it, please click to buy. Thank you. Okay, boys. Let's buy it. So, here we have, um, phone. Uh, this is the, it's supposed to be the newest Samsung one. Interestingly, uh, let's see what we got. So first off, I always make the comment, uh, Wish knows how to at least package their cameras, or not their cameras, their phones. Um, this is better packaging than the iPhones come in, so good for them. Uh, so we've got this box here. We've got a, uh, a bunch of, okay, a pretty standard white box. Uh, we've got the phone. I mean, I just gotta say real quick, I'm kind of surprised that, like, this isn't as bad as the iPhone. That's literally, like, a 10-year-old Android. Um, okay. I guess we want to peel off the back. I'm not even going to bother with peeling off that back. Hold up. So let me guess. You have problems with the battery again. You were at 50%. What more do you want? Okay, this one's at 69%. Now we're down to 67. I don't care. Let's see if we can just get to this video. Um, let's peel off the front here. Well, on the bright side, we have a screen protector and a little camera. And this is the power on. Oh, wow. Wow, we actually have a full screen. It's not, like, cut off or anything. You've got a nice chin on the back of this, though. And you've got that screen protector. Is there a way to open this up? Don't look like it. What else do we got in the box? Yo, it comes with a case. Okay. Unlock it. 
It's definitely not retina, and it's definitely not even close to the high definition. It's definitely still got some visible pixels in it. I mean, honestly, for what it looks like, it looks like a pretty, like, decent phone, I'd say. Sorry, go through, finish going through this, too. We've got earbuds. Got a little adapter. Brick. Oh, you have an SD card? A 256 gig unnamed micro SD card? Okay, well, I guess the next thing to do is check out the camera. What's up? I think that's like, maybe it's a 4x zoom on that. Nice to check out my Legos. I have a Lego addiction. More than I have a tech addiction. Um, but yeah, no. That's what it looks like. Quality, I would say, is okay. Like, you're not going to... This is probably around 15 FPS. Yeah, I noticed it actually slows down a lot when it's got a high ISO. Let's try to put in the SD card. So it's got an SD card with 250 gigs and it's got an internal storage of 512. So let's check it. I'll go back to that camera real quick to show you the front front end camera real quick. It, it, it changed a lot with the color. Look at the color difference here. So you can tell that like I'd say this camera is relatively accurate with the color because I have some some warm lights over here. So I'd say the, the camera you're seeing now is pretty accurate with the color. And uh, I put this up here and it looks... Uh, I mean, I, I, I'm pasty because I haven't been into the beach, but I mean, we can... This is, this is unflatteringly pasty. How about we just put it that way? Oh, I almost forgot to take out the Geiger counter and test this. See how radioactive it is? That's become a new meme on this channel that we have to test things because ever since those stickers came along, well, if you haven't watched the radioactive stickers video, that's um one of the best on this channel. Just so we're clear, I've been trying to get my refund back from Wish. Uh, no, I found like 12 Pro Max right here. This is the camera, guys. The, the the extra, you know, super pro cameras. Why won't they refund me? This is just like CNC and metal. So, the iPhone 10, guys. It's a kind of have a heavy phone. Like, I'm gonna be honest with you, my iPhone with the full case on there. I mean, for a hundred dollars. I mean, it looks kind of like modern and stuff. It's got the punch out camera. I've got no internet because we know that whatever I put on here is going to be sent to scam boogaloo servers. Um, FM radio. Well, I think there's headphones here. Let's see. I don't think this is the USB jack that's looking for, but sure, I could be wrong. Does this actually work? So that appears to work. Um, Apple, uh, why doesn't iPhone do that is my question. So you can listen to the radio. I, 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 it might be something Android's had for a bit. I just, I've had an iPhone. So fingerprint reader. Does not work at all. Surprised. Face unlock. Oh boy, let's try this face unlock. Enroll face. This is, this is why I'm not connected to the internet at the moment. This is going to be great. Let's see if face unlock works. Mmm, it do. Okay, so the fingerprint do not. Yet the face unlock does. So this is a testing of the microphone on the, what do we want to call this? The crap phone uh, S1. Uh, let's see how well it sounds when I play it at full volume. So this is a testing of the microphone on the, what do we want to call this, the crap phone, uh, S1. Uh, let's see how well it sounds when I play it at full volume. That might be off of this microphone too, so let's try that again. This is a test of the crap phone, uh, microphone test. I mean, it is not super great, 
but I definitely wouldn't bash it that bad. So um, I need to contact my bank and get this refunded because uh, this is definitely not anywhere close to what's advertised. Well, yes, it's... I mean, the fact that Wish has removed it from the store pretty much proves that it's a scam. Like, if Wish goes... If it's so bad that Wish goes through and removes it from the store, you that's pretty much like admission it's a, it's a fake product. So, here's the thing. You get a couple things from this. Cannot detect face. Well, no dip. Oh, wow. What do you get here? Um, you get a screen protector on this. I mean, that's, that's a good thing. The screen itself is not as high quality nor retina whatever i would call it um it's kind of a garbage screen i mean it looks like it doesn't have samsung on the back it's it's definitely like the camera obviously is not in the right place i mean it's here's the, it looks like the camera's supposed to be on the whole side here so i mean like it's it's clearly not what it's supposed to be it's it's a fake phone um as I said, I'd be very cautious with what you put in here because you don't want to have your uh, face on the front page of, uh, or have your face all over an internal server somewhere in another country. Um, then again, my face is all over YouTube, so <sighs> good for me. So you get like, like I can appreciate if we were to make some positive comments here, because there are a few and scarce. Uh, the radio is kind of nice. Uh, then again, I think Android has that, so good for them. Shame on you, Apple. Um, you have a charging brick. Apple doesn't have those. You have headphones. I don't think Apple does that either. Uh, you've got a case, and I mean, for the record, the case isn't half bad. I mean, I don't know if it's going to really stop any drop tests. But, I mean, sure. It's cool. You're still going to get, like, your camera whacked if you drop it in that way. Um, and you've got the charging cable. So, through it all, you've got a case, a screen protector, a phone. Like, it's not a bad deal. Will you get weird looks for having this phone? Maybe. Yeah, it's not a... I'm, I'm going to go contact my bank and get a charge back because that's this is ridiculous that Wish won't refund this crap. Y'all have a great day. I won't because I got to deal with this crap.